How about a breath of fresh air and a taste of some fresh food? We are heading to Sunset Bistro in Bowling Green on this week's Dine in the 419. Get ready for made to order food from a scratch kitchen with vegetarian options. It's all west of downtown BG on Wooster at Sunset Bistro. Sunset Bistro is a family restaurant. I love it here. We've been open since 2015. Uh, we specialize in chef-made food, so we do a lot of things from scratch. If you order an Alfredo and the ticket goes back, we actually start the sauce after the ticket goes to the kitchen. I do love that people feel really comfortable coming in here, no matter what their attire, if they're coming for work or for family celebrations. I'm in the kitchen with Chef Matt. Chef, what are we doing today? All right, we're gonna be making a couple things. We're gonna be making a sunset salad. We're gonna do a full pole burger. And we're also gonna do one of our veggie flatbreads. Can't wait. All right, so we got uh, some romaine here. We get uh, we get the heads in, freshly chop them every morning. A little bit of cheddar, a little bit of Monterey Jack, and then we got some peas, some garbanzo beans, and some black beans, and a little bit of diced tomatoes. And then we actually toss it with a uh, house-made dressing here. It's kind of like a zesty Italian. Take a couple rigatoni noodles here. And there we are. That's our sunset salad. Chef, we're back here with Schneem. Schneem is going to make something for us. What's Schneem doing? All right, so right now he's making a vegetarian flatbread. Um, so we got uh, chopped up broccoli, uh, zucchini, eggplant, and then cauliflower. And it goes on one of our uh, house-made pitas here. And then we'll finish plating it up, gets a little balsamic glaze on top of it. The other thing we're going to do is a uh, full pole burger. So here we go. And then we'll put the burger on the flat top to finish and melt the cheese. This is gourmet. It is scratch made and made to order. And boom, looks great. It's so much fun. Flatbread is a vegetarian flatbread. All kinds of veggies, a perfect oh. balsamic glaze, and yeah. it's made on a made-from-scratch pita. This is the signature salad of Sunset Bistro. Absolutely, <laughs> and I love it. It is spicy. It has crushed red peppers mm -hmm. in the dressing, mm -hmm. so it has a kick to it, but for me, it just makes me want to eat more salad. This is something even if you're not a vegetarian, oh, there's a spice. Yeah, right, right? <laughs> took a minute. This is the tractor pull burger. Yeah, the full pull burger. <laughs> pull yeah. pull? Full pull. Full pull. It's a favorite for people. The french fries are right on the sandwich. Yes, yeah. sir. Oh, it's coming there down it goes. out of there. Yeah. <laughs> Delicious. Oh. Mm. There's egg in my face, isn't there? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Rudy, thank you so much. This place is great. If you want to come on down to Sunset Bistro, it's on West Wooster, just west of the Wood County Hospital on the same side of the street. You can top it off with a conversation heart margarita for the month of February. Man, I'm going to dive into this. Cheers. Cheers. This is how you dine in the 419. Thank you. Okay. What a fun place. Yeah, I like I like fries on the burger too. I mentioned that. I like everything on the burger, but you don't one say. thing one thing we didn't get to show that they brought out afterwards okay. was the dill soup. And they announced on Facebook that they were making the dill soup that day and people uh, somebody came in uh -huh. from Finley because they oh, heard Hold on. That the Question. Dill soup was Dill pickle soup, soup or dill yeah. potato soup? It was dill pickle soup. It tasted like Pickles. pickles. Man, if you like pickles, you will love dill soup. It was something else, but everything there was great, so all, all chef's kiss. Hmm. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> well, thanks for watching Action News at 4. We appreciate it. Action News at 5 is up next.